Learning construction. Learn, share, expand. Hey guys, this is Ernie with learningconstruction.com. And today I would like to talk about how to install a sewer lateral line. Okay, so let's get started. The first thing that we want to do is to verify the slope that the line is going to be installed. Once you have established the elevation of the pipe and you have established the elevation of the invert of the pipe, which is more important, uh, you will have to start working on the excavation of your trench line. Typically on a sewer line, you would be using a bedding of sand. The sand is the sand is commonly used to create a bedding for the pipe and at the same time it allows you to be able to lay the pipe flat without having any voids on the invert on the line. Remember, this is a sewer line which is gravity fed. You want to make sure that when you place that line, there are no sags in the piping. You want to keep it as straight, following the slope uh, as possible. For information about what kind of sand bedding you need, you will have to contact your local sewer company or follow the state requirements or your county requirements for sewer line which most likely will require to be inspected by your local inspector once you have placed the bedding and verified your elevation you can start laying the pipe uh, the pipe that is very commonly used for laterals is SD35 or SD26 and this pipe is very common because because of its cost effectiveness and at the same time because of its easy installation. Uh, as you can see on this video over here, our guys are installing a piece of SD35 pipe and the installation is pretty simple. One of the things that you do is you have to grease or lubricate the o-ring that is on the fitting end of the pipe and once you have this fully lubricated you place the other pipe and you want to pry it and push it inside of the fitting now you notice that on one end of the pipe it has a marking which allows you to know how far in this pipe needs to be you gotta be really careful with this you wanna make sure that this pipe pushes himself all the way inside and it has a full connection with the fitting please make sure that you verify this once you install the pipe and check on all your connections remember that Typically in a sewer line this will be tested by air and also a video test will be performed or it should be performed to avoid having any type of leaks in the sewage line. Once you install the pipe you're going to go ahead and place the upper section of the bedding. Once you have this in place you can start backfilling your material and um, that's it for this video guys. I hope you guys liked it and don't forget to comment in the box below and let me know what you guys think. Uh, once again, thank you guys and don't forget to check out learningconstruction.com. Thank you.